This is Mary Shook and she is going to show you a tutorial on how to make your eyelashes longer when you have lost them from chemotherapy. Helping her is Amina Mir as she is going to model them. You need Mod Lash eyelashes, mascara, a highlighter slash brow pencil, duo eyelash adhesive, and tweezers. Anyway, so you can get this at the drugstore anywhere. I think these were dope. Three dollars and fifty cents. Them. But yeah, so we're gonna open this up for her, and then I told her she gets to do it all. <laughs> I'm scared. So the um, this stuff comes with sticky on it already. It's already sticky, and that's how it's sort of sticking on there. But you need glue on the eyelashes to just be able to get them yeah, to stick on you. Yeah, your eye. Oh, no. so, yeah. Duo. Yep, the duo. And duo is better because A, it holds really well, and B, there's the clear glue that gives you a lot of fumes around the eyes, and when your eyes are probably irritated right now from yeah. doing chemo, you don't want to put a lot of irritation around the eyes. So um, what you want to do is carefully lift up the strip yeah. just like you do that with tweezers doing. or you do that with You can do it with tweezers, but sometimes it breaks it, oh, but you so can we do don't it with the finger it. and just lightly lift it and just pull the strip up. So you want to just pull it along. There you go. I don't want to break them. Let's do it slowly. And we're just doing this gorilla style today because most people don't know how to put on lashes. Yeah, and I know. It's intimidating, and that's why we're just showing it raw style because this is not about being a pro professional makeup artist. This is about trying mm -hmm. to look better. So when you look at the eyelashes, the what goes on the outside is a longer part, and what goes on the inside is yep. a... On so you look at this... This matches up with this eye, that matches And you want to try to see if it definitely fits your eye. And so you've got such a large eye that I don't think it's going to be a problem okay. anyway. So you try and match it up to your eye? Yep. Just take that off, okay. and then you're going to put a little bit of a line just at the edge of it. So oh, now I can't take it off. <laughs> okay. There we go. All right. Okay, so you're going to take a little bit just like this. I'm going to right, start it you for you. Mm -hmm. You're going to start just taking it like that and just coating it a little bit okay. through the lash. Yeah. Mm -hmm. And then you want it to set for a second. So you're going to blow on it for a couple seconds. And then you also want to try to mold it while you're doing that. So like so curl, curve it around a little bit. So it fits more yeah, to Yeah, exactly. So you're going to do that with a little bit of blowing, and you're making it tacky right now. So you're molding it. So and like you it do with like Elmer's glue, so it doesn't all glob out. Yep. I'm try and start it. Right in the way. middle looks great, and then, yep. And then you want to get as close to your lashes as possible, or what okay. would be your lashes? And then while it's still wet, you want to shove it down towards the eyelash. Perfect. And then start pushing it in so that it's setting. Okay. And you're probably thinking, oh boy, you can see the lash yeah. on me. And there's a trick for that. Yeah, what's the trick because it's... The trick is, is that you're going to put some shadow over that. So what you're going to do, because the glue is still setting, is yeah. you're going to do the other eye now. Okay. <laughs> but you're, we're going to show you how to cheat and okay. fix that. Okay. So um, go ahead and take off the second strip. And what I can do is just take the excess glue and just, I've got a Q-tip that's got right. extra stuff on it. Oh yeah, that's a really remover. good product. I really like those. Yeah. Then what you want to do is take just a regular cheap yeah. drugstore type of, of thing and then just rub it in the lash line after it's dry and yours is basically dry. So start with the in right In the side. lash line, you mean just like in between the, the two? Yeah, but yeah. I mean just above, below, just try, trying to conceal right. the whole thing. So you're just... So it looks like it's all one yep. thing. Because you don't want it to do that. And just make sure you don't rub the lash off. Right. But at this point, when you're doing this, the glue should be set. So yes. it's not like you could really rub the lash off. I mean, unless you rub it super hard. But this, Which you don't want to do your eyes anyway. No. This could last you a few days, though, if you do it right. And yeah. Right now, because you're still learning, yeah. I would just practice every day in yeah. doing it. And they're washable. So you, when you wash it, you want to wash it in like a shampoo. Oh, you can or, reuse this. Yes, one? you can reuse the same oh, one. Oh, it's so great. That's a good deal for $3. Yeah. Yep. We didn't want to go this intense. I'm just showing something that 
takes the lash, and it's almost like you can't even tell it's there. Let's see. Oh, it's so nice. Yeah. And then this is the new, brand new, no one's ever seen oh, wow. this. Clinique. Look at that cool mascara. It's got a really interesting edge. Yeah. And yeah, it's just a really cool comb. Cool. Yeah. So to just keep it light, yeah. just do like the tips of your lashes with it. Really great mm -hmm. mascara though, because it really comes through. Yeah, it doesn't make it all lumpy. No, I've been really excited about using this. And you can also wash off this mascara too on the, the, the lashes. So just use a little mild shampoo. And then here's another great thing, which is an eye highlighter, which they just came out with. And it's actually not even out yet. It'll be out in February, I believe. And it just opens up the eye a little bit more. It gives it something. And then on this, they have a great pencil that is like a no-brainer. I like it because A, it stays really well, and B, because it's so light and it can go on a lot of different brows and because right. you're so concerned about losing your brows right now yeah. this is a great filler without making you look like i drew them on yeah like you drew that's so cool yay thank that's you to get some lashes thank you thank you <laughs> okay all right yay.